thinking they might try to push the envelope. We saw that from Derek Shelton opening day. Pirates were uh, off and running. They stole three bases, four attempts. And now a little concern about Key Brian Hayes. They saw something they didn't like. Oh, no, he's pointing to his uh -huh. hand. In that case, I'd almost wish it was going yeah. if it's something wrong with his hand. Oh, I don't see anything there. Didn't jam his fingers or anything. Maybe I was looking at the wrong hand. Four years, Pirates made a bunch of changes with the training staff. And Key Brian Hayes assures his manager that uh, he's okay to stay in the game. Man, pit in your stomach when you oh, see. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, especially when they start looking at the back of his hand. Oh, I'm like, boy. oh, no. Kevin Newman and a bouncer headed up the middle. And the Pirates take a 1-0 lead. A slow bounding ball to center field, and Kevin Newman scores Hayes, 1-0 Pirates. It, you know why he gets hits like that is because of the way he sprays the ball around. You can't load up in one spot. You can't bring your second baseman to take away that ground ball up the middle. Well-placed ground ball back over the top, and it's through. Rip to left. And a base hit, so Baez stayed back and hammered that one. Runner goes. Pitch is low. Stolen base. Javi swipes the bag. Javi taking off for third. Swing and a miss. And a stolen base. So Baez being aggressive. Two steals in the inning at Almeida third. And the Cubs can tie this one up without a hit. Again, it's at that leg action that really buys extra time for the base runner here. Javi had a great lead, great jump, and again, a, a no shot for Stallings probably shouldn't even have bothered to make this throw. In the air, and that shallow towards right. Falling, and it gets down for a hit. In to score, Javi Baez Mariznik. And it's 1 1. React to where, what you see. In the air, right center field. Fowler, long run, tracks it down. Mariznik will tag from third. And David Bodie is giving the Cubs the lead. It's 2 1. That's hammered out to center. Fowler back. Back some more onto the track. Turning and looking, and it's gone! Chris Bryant will circle the bases, and it's 3 1. KB's first of the year. Well, he hits them high, doesn't he? Yeah, he sure does. You know, he hits some majestic, powering home runs to the pull side. This time it's straightaway center field. It was tough to read it the way Fowler was tracking that ball. Looked for a minute like he was going to be able to make a play on it. But it showed you how the wind is influencing the ball center, right center, and right, giving it a little extra push. He'd be able to ride that one out of here. Jake, uh, the snake, you may know him by. He's the starting pitcher for the Cubs today. He's, Jake's been really good against the Pirates over the years. And a swing and a miss right there. Jake gets the strikeout to away. Pitch is in there, got him. And Arietta gets the punch out, and that is that. In the big leagues, it was a real problem. Got him, throws it. And Arietta able to get him one, two, three, his third strikeout. When I was a kid, I thought the term. Side corner got him. And Moran left frozen. Strikeout number five. Two seam fastball. Grandpa Rossi to be, you know, have some space. That one is deep to right. Way back. And out of here. That had some space to it. Cleared the fence by a ton. 
That was a star scraper. That's what that was. <laughs> Hayward Spurs Cubs extend the lead. It is 4 1, second hit of the day for Jay Hay. Here's an 0 2. And that gets through for a base hit. Why are you throwing him a strike? I think command is the issue. I, I, I think Crow right now is, is a little anxious and he's overthrowing and he really doesn't have a good feel for where it's going. You know, you try to overthrow it. I'm going to throw my nastiest best slider here. You hump up, you muscle up, you lose feel. You leave in the middle of the strike zone. Baez the knock. That's his second hit of the day. Yeah. Outside corner, and that is that. Moran is gone. One away. Back in the sink. Three consecutive punch outs recorded by Cubs pitchers. Boy, the bullpen really struggled in the opener. They've been spot on here this afternoon. Backdoor breaking ball clips the outside corner. And Moran just takes the slow moonwalk back to the dugout. Inside corner got him. And Kimbrell has struck out the first two. A little 96 piece inside corner at the knees. One, two. Inside corner, ball game. Cubs win. Five one and the Cubs on the return of Jake Arietta. Kimbrell comes in and strikes out the side to close it out.